Uh, hi guys, welcome to this session, Seeing AI is widely used in education. I'm Chen from Vanware. First, let me introduce why we should focus on Seeing AI, which is cloud native and artificial intelligence uh, on education area. So in March this year, our CNCF community points out that education for kids is one of the big challenges that Seeing AI is facing. And after researching on how Seeing AI is, uh, how Seeing AI is used on the uh, education area, we are glad to see that um, uh, Seeing AI is rapidly developed in the education area. So for AI in classroom, the teachers will use AI to correct the homework and also answer the questions. And for the college students, uh, teacher will encourage them to use AI technology like the Copilot to help with their schoolwork. For the after school classes, parents will uh, choose AI related classes for their children from, from a very young age. So let's move to the AI software part. So currently, AI software is still driven by the uh, children's schoolwork, aiming to get a better score. Uh, however, the students are still uh, passive learners and need to be supervised by the teachers and by their parents. Uh, I'm wondering if AI technology can help children uh, to change them from passive learners to active learners. I believe this can be realized because uh, children are curious by nature. They always ask questions on their unknown. However, their parents might not answer all the questions uh, because they don't have time or they're not professional enough to uh, explain the things correctly. I think an AI chat application would solve this problem uh, perfectly because this application can respond to children's questions anytime and any place. And it will provide very professional instructions for kids. I made a prototype of this idea and uh, it is a sports tutor application. Uh, let's watch the demo. So the children can ask how to swim and will gather all the information and the knowledge they need. It will also uh, gather the videos from YouTube about the uh, swimming tutorials. And these videos are filters uh, for kids. Children can pick up any videos that they are interested in. and it will also uh, generate the GIFs of the swimming uh, strokes. I believe this application can help children to learn what they really want and also help them develop the ability of self-learning. Okay, uh, let's think about if it's possible for children to understand the cloud native. Uh, taking Kubernetes architecture as an example, it would be difficult for children to understand exactly what each component is doing. But this, uh, since this architecture is moduled clearly, children can just learn how to classify each component, like which belongs to the control plane and which belongs to the uh, containers. We can design an application or a game for the children to let them drag all the components to where it should be. Uh, in this way, children can learn uh, how or uh, build a basic picture of the cloud native. Uh, there are still a lot of other topics like the AI abuse uh, to be discussed but the time is very limited. Uh, we can continue our discussions on the Slack channel, Seeing AI for Kids, in the CNCF Slack workspace. And also, for more information, you can visit this website or contact me directly. Hope that we can get together and uh, uh, find a way to let Seeing AI benefit more for the kids' education. Thank you.